There was recently an instance in Canada where a dog got poisoned and paralyzed uh, due to accidentally ingesting some essential oils. The owners did not know that the essential oils that they were using in their house, that the, uh, the oils that they were diffusing could in fact be harmful to their baby. It's a very sad instance and something which could have been avoided uh, had the necessary information uh, been available uh, to the owners. So this instance is what has prompted me today to make this video and to help you become aware of uh, which are the essential oils that you should avoid uh, using at home if you have uh, pet babies around. Uh, but before we proceed, uh, if you have uh, pets at home and you like using essential oils, uh, please leave a yes in the comments below so that we know that we are reaching out to a large number of people. And if you've not already, please subscribe to the channel uh, and like the video so that the YouTube algorithm picks it up and helps us spread this important information. So to begin with, uh, as we explained in our previous video, there are two ways that essential oils can cause harm to your pets. Uh, one is by accidental ingestion. Uh, and second is by neurological issues that can happen when they are inhaled because they have extremely super sensitive uh, noses and uh, neurological systems. Now, which are the essential oils that you should not use or you should avoid using at home when uh, you have pets around? Uh, so I'm going to list them out now. Uh, I will not go into a lot of details so that to make it simple. But uh, if you want more details, we'll be following up with a link in the description below about a blog where you can read more about each and every oil and how it affects your pets. So the first essential oil that you should be careful about using is eucalyptus. Next is orange, then tea tree, then we have cinnamon, uh, peppermint, uh, then another popular one is wintergreen, then uh, pine, uh, ylang ylang is another one which is uh, which can be very harmful. Uh, next is clove and the tenth one is garlic. So these were the ten essential oils that are and are potentially harmful to your pets. Uh, and you should be careful when using them and it is better to avoid them and use alternate uh, essential oils. Uh, but always remember, this is not a complete list of essential oils that, are, that can be harmful. There are others as well, uh, not as harmful, but these are the top 10 ones. Uh, so it's best to research about any essential oil that you're using at home. Uh, if they're safe for pets, uh, do a little bit of, uh, you know, searching online on Google and make sure that the oils that you're using for your pets have been uh, tested pet safe and pet friendly. So if you liked uh, the information that we provided to you today, uh, please uh, like and share this video and subscribe to the channel and help spread the information to other pet parents. Thank you and always remember to keep it natural.